Galactic Federation of Light Update, December 13, 2016. 10 Carbon, 0 Mole, 13 Carbon. Drazo. Events are moving forward. The top of the RV payout is now in place. This means that the deliveries of the Prosperity Funds are very close to actually occurring. We expect this process ultimately to lead to the formal announcement of Nasara and the New American Republic. This series of operations is to follow in a set sequence, and a number of joint legal decisions are to ensure that it is quickly and efficiently carried out. Thus, we anticipate that numerous actions are to follow one another, so this new reality can be properly manifested. These sequences are to be followed swiftly with full disclosure of our benevolent existence. At that time, as noted previously, we are to broadcast a brief outline of possible actions that are to lead to a potential time for mass landings. Each of these events is linked to the other. A long series of meetings involving the different factions has contributed to a very complex timetable. This process has brought together various teams, assisting us in moving forward. Hence, we ask for patience as these joint timetables are taking place. The whole process of altering this planetary society has been much more complicated than first imagined. This realm was initially conceived of by the Anunnaki as a land that possessed a primary belief that those in power were invincible. Thus, the present group of minions saw themselves as beings capable of overcoming anything that might reduce or end their power. A most arrogant set of beliefs was deeply etched into everyone's psyche. One of the many reasons for our difficulty in aiding our partners in the light was these insane core conceptions. This belief is now receding, as day by day, heaven aims at burst of positive and consciousness raising energies at humanity. We have watched as our earthly partners succeeded in altering this negative belief and initiated a series of major arrests among this global group of minions. The aim of this operation is to ensure that prosperity leads directly into a Gisara for this long-suffering world. Step by step, this is indeed becoming the case. These events are part of a larger project, which is to form the foundation of the realm where we intend to land when the divine time is right. This is a continuation of a position that we, with the Ascended Masters, wish to complete in the very near future. Gaia's peoples are in the midst of an ever-growing series of population cycles. Our responsibility is to make sure that the most critical aspects of this globe achieve the funds required to set up a number of key objectives. These include fresh water, electrification, and a modern sewage system. It is horrifying to us that most of this planet lacks the means to connect to the Internet and to live at night in an electrified environment. These primitive conditions need to be transformed quickly. There are enough energy and funds in this world to swiftly change this. These problems, along with a growing need for illiteracy, are to be addressed by our earthly associates. Heaven first created this entire project long ago when they solemnly addressed the Ascended Masters. They decreed that the new reality that was to free surface humanity was to be noted for its never-ending prosperity accompanied by the return of your long-awaited freedom. Humanity was to regain the individual sovereignty lost by the illegal proclamations of the Anunnaki, thereby divinely righting this grievous wrong. It was to be the prime mission of the Ascended Masters, to oversee and aid humanity as provided for by several rules designated to this task by Heaven. These rules were followed as well as the edict to provide the necessary monies to set up such an immense prosperity. In addition, a special team was to be established to legally overthrow the Anunnaki's minions when required. Now that this task is complete, you are ready to feast on the fruits of this mighty effort. These projects were further supported by our arrival as commanded by Heaven. The next steps are to enable the completion of the events that constitute this special operation and prepare us for first contact. Namaste. We are your Ascended Masters. This next period in your spiritual development precludes a return by the dark to any semblance of power. The blessed administrations of heaven preordained their defeat. This is a divine process you can truly celebrate. Be truly aware of what is happening and apply your exceptional visionary skills to this vital topic. 
Heaven has orchestrated a process that is quite divine. Look upon this current reality as a clever way to check who is on board for the extraordinary changes that are to follow. Thirteen millennia ago, the dark took charge of this reality and created a world that was horrific for all of its surface humanity. It is vital that all who are opposed to these changes show their true colors and be added to the already long list of those who were to be divinely isolated from you. Therefore, this blessed scenario is in readiness to reveal who supports or does not support the new republic. We ask simply that you bear with this and prepare yourselves for a coming grand announcement. Heaven does not wish anyone to continue to suffer. Once this process has finished, we fully intend to introduce the true American governance and end the dark farce that commenced nearly 150 years ago. When the original Constitution was first proclaimed, it lacked the Bill of Rights. Once added, this system of governance was legally proclaimed. The same is true now. Only the blessed documents of Nasara are to become legal. Have patience and know in your heart what is to happen shortly. Come together and be aware of what is occurring and use your energies to enable us to triumph. Those who now so arrogantly parade around are to be isolated by our sacred associates. This operation has already begun. Be patient and allow it to manifest and transform this reality. Remember, dear ones, this reality is resolutely breaking away from the darkness and bringing in the light. This operation requires a series of false flags to secure the proposition that all aspects of the old oligarchy are successfully captured and firmly isolated from you. This process needed a means to permit those secured under their proverbial rocks to come out and clearly reveal themselves to our associates. This operation is taking a little longer than at first proposed. Be patient, blessed ones. This entire process is soon to be altered by a series of key announcements. Then the new governance can reveal itself and this reality can truly be transformed for the better. This divine operation is bringing out all who were buried so deeply that selected sweeps by our associates were unable to find them. The time that we divinely intend to manifest is quite near. Hosanna! 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 Today, we carried on with our weekly report. We have reviewed what is developing across this beautiful blue-green orb and see how the forces of the light are bringing together their great victory. Much is unfolding that is about to transform this world for the better. No, dear ones, that the countless supply and never-ending prosperity of heaven are indeed yours. So be it. Selamat Gajan. Selamat Ya, Syrian for B1. And be in joy. Channeled by Sheldon Nidal. www.paoweb.com